Hi, my friend Matthew Barnett asked me to record a video to introduce myself to his Facebook group, The Horror Theme. My name is John Kirsch and I was in the 1968 film, Night of the Living Dead. The film got a lot of ink in the local press while it was still in production. People were talking and I wanted to be part of it. I was fortunate to meet Jack Givens, who worked at a recording studio owned by Carl Hardman. He got me to the location and into the movie. I was 15 years old at that time. It was very exciting as Jack and I dodged Molotov cocktails. Then I got to watch them set fire to John Russo. Two guys stood just out of frame with blankets to smother the flames as soon as John dropped. Later in the movie, I'm among the ghouls who ultimately break into the farmhouse. Jack has a table leg to bash at the door as I come up from the rear to paw at the decorative moldings with my fingernails. I got to go to the world premiere. Soon the film would expose the world to new levels of cinematic gore as well as to the musical tones of the Pittsburgh dialect. Yeah, they're dead. They're all messed up. Now, I have almost 30 seconds of screen time in Night of the Living Dead, and in three of those seconds, I'm actually recognizable. Those three seconds made me a celebrity in high school. I tried repeatedly to recreate the experience. Then I got a job at the neighborhood movie theater and Night of the Living Dead played there. My boss put my name on the box office schedule. A reunion for cast and crew has been staged for the past several years in Evan City, Pennsylvania, where the film was primarily shot. It's a great event for fans to mingle with those who made the movie. They're coming to get you, Barbara. Johnny, you're ignorant. Something wonderful happens every year. The release of the newly remastered 4K Criterion version was celebrated with yet another world premiere. It was held on the same date and in the same theater as it was 50 years ago. I walked the red carpet with my niece as my date as my three seconds of screen time knocked another couple minutes from my allotted 15 minutes of fame. My fondest memories of my high school years involved murder. <laughs> And that's about it in a nutshell. Thank you very much, Matthew, for inviting me to participate in the horror theme.